Good evening, ladies and gentlemen, lounging with Lisa, the video series that has me lounging while coming at you with hair that I've pulled wildly most of the afternoon with thoughts of the day. Um, I did a video earlier in Edna. It was a pretty long video, like 10 minutes long, but I deleted it. And, well, I didn't delete it. For, I didn't say anything weird. I just thought it's not that good of a video, really. I mean, when are they? I'll, although the tour today, I think, was pretty good. I might run a comb through my hair and teeth. Hang on. It was useless, so I did this. Here we are. Um, I don't really have much to report. I just thought I'd drop in since you didn't get to see my delightful face today, ladies and gentlemen. And I know you can't live without me. I wear an apron all the time now when I'm at home. Oh, my. Is it, oh, no, it's not inside out. This was Mother's catering business back in the day. That was wild. She had this, um, what was it, a Lincoln Town car, Lincoln car, something big. Mother likes big cars. She feels safe in them. It's going to drive me nutty. Um, and she could fit so many things in there. I couldn't believe it. All the jazz she'd fit in there for the catering gigs. And that's how she did them, by way of her vehicle. Yeah. We would load them in, and then I moved off to Houston after that. I couldn't handle helping her load up her vehicle any longer, ladies and gentlemen. Yeah, so I did the video from Edna earlier, which is clean. I don't think you could see me if I went there now. I could try. I really don't want to. I'll do it another day. Um, yeah, I don't... Oh, I know what I'm going to tell you. I know what I'm going to tell you. Uh, elsewhere. Your items are being shipped tomorrow by my mother. She's uh, my personal errand runner now at age 93. I send her packing all the time with things. <laughs> I'm kind of kidding, although I asked her if she was uh, going to the post office. If she would mind mailing that for me, so you should get it, I don't know, sometime. What's tomorrow? Thursday? You know, by Monday probably or Saturday or something like that. And I'm finally getting together a birthday package for my sister who celebrated her birthday on April... 14th or 16th. I think it's the 16th. I get confused. It's one of those two dates. I think it's April 16th. Yeah. And um, I'm a little late with it because it's May something, a month late. But um, thank goodness I get stuff at the end of the year. Like after any season, I kind of go and get it when it's super marked down and then I store it forever. And then I give it away. Of course, I've been doing some homemade jazz as well. I'm boring myself to tears, ladies and gentlemen, here talking to you. I might delete the video. I don't really have much to say other than we went out and did our, uh, I guess every 10 days or so running around, maybe every week. I can't, I'm not really keeping track of it. Got some stuff that I need. I'm looking over there because of Bernard. Venus is not out yet for me to freak out over. Have you seen the moon lately? Oh, I'll tell you that in a minute. Uh, hang on. I don't know, I was bloviating about Patty, and we did this and that, and ran errands. It wasn't anything earth-shattering. It was fun, as usual. But And I enjoyed the tour of the farm, of course. I hope you did. Uh, I've been doing projects galore. I Well, I showed you the junk drawer, didn't I? I feel like I have something there. Uh, it's like a little wrinkle that gets in my lip. <laughs> okay. Uh, yeah, I showed you the junk drawer, and then I forgot. Remember, I cleaned the pantry. The, the cabinet we call the pantry, we don't keep food in it. I know it's strange. We have strange names. Like, we call that room that goes from the kitchen into the room formerly known as the child's or down into our vast basement, which isn't a basement. It's a laundry room. I've been over this before. Uh, I call it the coffee cup room or the coffee room because we used to have a bun coffee maker, and that's where it was. I don't know what's called, ladies and gentlemen. Maybe we can have a contest. Name that room. Oh, speaking of uh, having a contest, I don't need to look over there suspiciously anymore. Uh, yeah, this weekend. I don't have a birthday. Mew Mew Q has not gotten with me yet. If you're watching this Mew Mew Q, Mew Mew Q, I can still celebrate your birthday, which I realized was last Sunday, but I can do it this Sunday. But I need to hear from you by tomorrow at noon. No, I'm kidding. It doesn't matter at noon. Tomorrow at some point, like afternoon or what have you. Oh. I think there's some birds there. <laughs> oh, he went over there now. I this isn't I don't even know what I'm doing here, ladies and gentlemen. I have had some hummers now, hummingbirds, see? They're not there right now, so I don't know why I'm showing you the thing. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I think we'll just do kind of a game to celebrate the lounge. 
It's not my anniversary of going live, though. That's in September. It's just the anniversary of my having a channel. And so I thought that I would... I just said, and so I thought that I would maybe... Uh, like, do a few... A little bit of this and a little bit of that. And a little bit of the other. Rather than just have a game game. Like, I could have a few in the manner or in the style of OBP, like Off the Beaten Path. And I can have a few in the style of... Uh, um, oh, oh, God, name something, WMB, or, um, Family Feud, or Lounging Feud, whatever. <sighs> I just thought I'd sit here and not say anything for a minute, see if I can do it. Let me try. Okay, that's that. I think I'm done. I'm really... There's birds back. I don't know if I can catch them. I'm looking over there real sneaky. Okay, I am done, ladies and gentlemen. This is ridiculous. Lounging with Lisa, the video series that has me paranoid. <laughs> While coming at you with thoughts of the day, I just remembered the moon. I woke up to use the facilities last night. I looked out the window. And the moon was like a half moon. And it was sort of just hanging out. <laughs> like, what else would it be doing? Sitting around playing cards with the sun. Anyhow, it was just sort of hanging out. And it was kind of bright. And the birds were kind of chirping. I'm getting a message from uh, Karen Peterson. Let me see what it says. <laughs> I really am going to do it. Tomorrow after 12. Okay. <laughs> this is hilarious. I Okay. It's in terms of Basil's phone call that it's, uh, we're lining up a time to do a phone call and she said tomorrow afternoon. I guess it'll be okay. That is my deadline day. I still have a deadline, believe it or not. Now that I save everything till Thursday, everything. Because I just have to contact a few people and write a column. I don't really feel like writing a column. Does anybody want to write my column for me, please? Um, yeah, I haven't had anybody reach out to do the, the um, NFBOW column, Nameless Faceless Business Owner of the Week, where they complain wildly or embrace or whatever the heck they're going to do in terms of this, um, you know, whole situation going on with having to shut down and whatnot. I had three people do it. Three, three. And then I had to do a column last week. I just don't feel like it, ladies and gentlemen. Don't make me do it. I don't know where I was at all. I don't know what I was saying. I don't know what... I did the moon. Okay. So it was over there, and it was kind of getting light out at the same time. It must have been 5 in the morning or something. And birds were chirping, and then all of a sudden I woke up again. I can't keep track of when I woke up, but all I know is the sun was rising, and the moon was hanging out over there at the simultaneous lie. That's so weird to me. I don't really understand it. Maybe you can explain it. I understand the concept of, like, this one's here and that one's there, and the shines and hits there, and then you get the shadow, and it's a thing. It just seems weird to me, ladies and gentlemen. Help me out here, would you? Okay, I'm done. Good gravy. Eight minutes of nothing. Uh, join me. I don't know where I was in my closing. Lounging with Lisa. Video series lounging at you with thoughts of day. Join me. Join others. Drop your political identities. Let's focus on issues. Leave labels at the door. Research before you judge. Remember, war is a racket. Don't take my word for it. Check out. Don't take my word for it. Check out General Smedley Butler and what he had to say. Okay, bye.